exciting. So to mark this anniversary, we thought we'd give you a special sneak peek behind the scenes of our Studio 1A. We're spread out all over the studio. We're ready to show you around. Now, just so you know, this is actually three floors. We're going to work our way up. And Carson, you're going to start us off. You're at the bottom in the basement. Good morning. Good morning, Savannah. Yeah, I'm down here in the concourse level. I'm one level right there below where you are in the studio. Before I go in, this is a popular level because the control room is here, and I'll take you in there in a second. When my kids come, they love this. This is the world's skinniest escalator. It is a very, very big attraction here. But come on into the Today Show. and we're in the scenes look at everything, as you saw in that piece, the great history, 25 years of Studio 1A. Great security here. What up, Damar? So you got all this, uh, you got Dave Garraway's name up here. This is the entrance. But when people come to the Today Show, really they want to go to the epicenter, the brain trust of the entire show. As you can imagine, our show is a 24-hour living, breathing operation. People are here at NBC News all times of the day. They're gathering news, they're editing, they're writing, they're getting ready for the show. And this is, this is where it all happens. We don't come in here that often, but we'd like to take you in now. Hello, everybody. So this is our control room, which you saw in the piece, we were the first network to, to go to color. This is now all HD, which we, I think, did about a year and a half ago. You've got the execs in the back row. You've got graphics coming from right here. You've got editing, the teleprompter, which is blank right now. So this is off the dome, as they say. And, um, and all the bigwigs. So, Libby, how are you doing? How's the show? Jimmy, our director. Maz, how are we doing on time today? Good, you better keep moving. I'm going to keep it going a little bit. Yeah. Lots to see inside Studio 1A. You know, the hardworking people here, they're here, it really is our production assistants. They make a lot of this possible. They come here at ungodly hours, and they do all the work. By the way, this elevator, shoot this. This is the original elevator when this building was a bank. It gets crowded. It's very small like the escalator. Guys, how are you? Going up. It's also very, very slow. This is Jaslyn, one of our production assistants, a.k.a. Jazzy J. What up? What up? What time did you wake up this morning? 3 a.m. 3 a.m. Ouch. That is early. So, yeah, they're busy getting this machine machines up oh, thank you very much so we get our scripts and we go up the stairs to that main level this is one of my favorite things right here john if you get a shot of it i'm a big irish fan so we hit that before we get to our broadcast and i'm going to pass it off daily toss to savannah so here's savannah all right all right thank you carson you okay now we're right at the door of studio 1a this is the thing that you see on tv every day we walk right in here and down the hallway and this is where we greet you every morning, 7 a.m. We call it home base. That's where we deliver the news of the morning. The thing I really want to tell you about is our beautiful crew. You know, some of these guys have been here. They were here 25 years ago, if not before. Like Bob Yeager, my friend. We Man. call him Rope. We do. Rope, when you started, they used to call you the kid. How, they old, did. how old were you? I was 24 when <laughs> well, I started. Crew, the crew loves that. <laughs> <laughs> so that was 25 years ago. 35 years ago. 35 years ago I when you started. Right. Do you remember when they opened this window on the world? I do. Yeah. I the show was two hours old, long then. Oh, yeah. And I didn't need glasses. No, I know. <laughs> Rope, you and the rest of the crew, you're the heart and soul of this place. Thank we you. love you so much. It's love your anniversary, show. too. Now, of course, you probably recognize this. It's Al's weather monitor. Let me see if I can... Yeah, we get the temperature inside Studio 1A, 67 degrees. Looks like Roker's been managing the thermostat again. It's always a little bit cold in this studio, and the guys and girls have a fight about that. And here is our desk, although today we're using the very desk that Katie and Bryant had. But you know what they didn't have? A rotating set. Yes, yeah, so we go from our window on the world, we turn it around, and it opens up a view into our studio, which we use for so many different things. And Craig, you can tell hey, that story here. Good to see you there, Savannah Guthrie. So one of the most coveted parts of this studio here in 1A is this wall, this magic wall, the 1A wall area. Um, it's a thing of beauty. The producers actually fight over it in terms of which segments can actually go here at the wall. So we use this thing for just about everything. Of course, a lot of the interviews happen in this space. In addition to the interviews, we also do, when we're not out on the plaza having a concert, we'll do the concerts here in 1A as well. We use the wall for the concerts. Of course, Kelly Clarkson. Celebrities love the wall. You should see the number of people who come into this studio and look at the wall. We put like plaster their pictures and the movies and the shows. They look at the wall, they take it all in. And of course, my favorite, the cooking segments. The cooking segments happen here at the wall as well. We use this thing for just about everything. Here's something else you probably don't know about Studio 1A. It's, it's a working studio. So, sorry, Jerry, sorry, sorry, Gerard. So a lot of times, things are coming in and out during the actual show. It's, they're like a NASCAR pit crew, these guys. This is the scene dock. Behind the scenes here, a lot of those food segments we were just talking about, 
Our prep kitchen. Our prep kitchen here. Oh, look. Hey, look, yeah. it's Ashley. It's Anthony. It's Katie. The whole get Tina's down there. What are we <laughs> having this morning? Making breakfast. You want some donuts? Donuts at this. This is actually my favorite part of the dinner, Jeff. <laughs> Beer. It's always very, very good, by the way. So, in addition to the food being prepped back here, all kinds of random stuff that we use on the show. Got a drum here. Got a football. We're number one. You know, so you never know when you're going to need that. Fake flowers. Disco balls as well. Never know what you're going to find back here. Like this random megaphone. Not sure why it's here, but we'll use it. Welcome! All right, thank you, Craig. Well, this is uh, where we like to call this special effects or makeup, where they make us look good. Mary Kaler, Laura Castorino, they've been here uh, when we first opened up. Oh, you know who's been missing? Hoda, we've missed you so much. Come back soon. Here, come with me on the tour. Uh, again, the hair and makeup. And then, of course, we've got our, our hallway where we go back to our wardrobe area. Hey. Oh, hey, Hoda. Say hi to Hoda. How are you? I'm sure Hoda would agree. She would. You're one of the hardest working men in this building. While you do this, I'm going to work on the third hour. All righty, that's All right. right. At third hour today. So let's go over to the wardrobe area. This is where we coordinate our wardrobes, make sure we look good. Uh, here's Lyle and Alex hanging out. And how do I look, guys? Great. Look great. Well, thank you. All right. I guess I'll just. Oh, oh. oh. sorry, I was just changing. <laughs> well, something on your Little jacket. Smuts. Is this from a long time ago? This is actually yes, from 1994. Why so. the hell? Oh. And then, of course, we spend a lot of time in here in our kitchen. This area is called the spa, the satellite production area. And we've got Curtis Stone oh, making yeah. us up our little sunrise. How's it going? Good, mate. How are you? Good. You, I mean, you love cooking here, don't you? I love it, and I love cutting your oranges every morning. I've been coming here for 12 years, and every day you make me cut your oranges. That's right. That's how here it, it is. It takes a pro. That's how the pros do it. Curtis, thank you so much. And of course, this is where we conduct other interviews when we. We've got other stuff going on downstairs, and here we wow. are up Yay! here. Yay! 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 to give that tour because you were here. You are the heart and soul of this place as well. What do you remember about this building? You were over here at 30 Rock back You kept then. coming over and looking. It's like when you're buying a house and you come to see how it's it, how the construction's <laughs> going. Yeah. We come in and look. It was amazing. And we thought, well, but what if they we open it up and nobody shows up? Wow. Of course, that didn't happen. And then everybody decided they had to get an outdoor studio. Television mm -hmm. is the, the sincerest form of flattery. <laughs> yes. So everybody copied way, us. On that tour, we made this place look a lot bigger than bigger it actually than it is. is. Yeah. 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 We yeah. use What's every it? inch of this Absolutely. place for production. When people come to visit, that's inevitably the first and they say, I can't believe it's so small. It really is pretty intimate. And Savannah, yeah. when you were showing those pictures, those black and white pictures, it makes us feel like we're really part of something greater, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. It's such a legacy here. Yeah, absolutely. Al, you're out on the plaza, I think, more than anybody else. What do people say to you when they come here? Why do they come? They come to be part of our family. I mean, they are part of our family, yeah. and that's what really sets us apart. I think people, you know, they were worried at first that it would just be maybe some New Yorkers and nobody else, and this has all become a world. destination. Yeah. As you said, all, it's in International. People come from all around the country, all around the world, just to be part of this. In a day and age of social media, when you know, everybody can see everybody else, they still love coming here. They do. Right. And you know what I love? They come to celebrate. If yes. they have an event, yeah. mm -hmm. if they have a, want to give a shout out to somebody, this is where they come. And we really, we were so honored by that. We're going to have a lot more just ahead. We're going to look back. There are some great memories that we've had here, some highlights the epic concerts, the unforgettable costumes, the weather the food? out on the plaza. The food. It can be a little, a little changeable. Dicey, yes, it food. can. Yes. I love it. But first, your local news and weather. Oh, Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody.